Hey everybody, welcome back to the Nidus Anarchy series. I'm your host Adam, CIO and co-founder of Nidus. And today I want to talk about a couple of the comments about Facebook hacking Snapchat because someone brought up a good point thinking that this may be the end of private conversations. So they're right and they're wrong. So first off, let's talk about the actual comment. So this comes from Shitbox Garage. I shit you not, this is his name. <laughs> and it says, can't believe this isn't all over. Absolutely crazy. Anyone feel like the end-to-end -end encrypted messenger is just false sense of security? So let's talk about this. Sense of security with private messaging or encrypted messaging. There's lots of different platforms that people think they're having encrypted message that's going back and forth between the people and it's, it's not actually happening and that's something i really want to bring up with everybody most notably is telegram i use telegram a lot it's my, one of my favorite messengers i use it with all kinds of friends and family around the world and most people think that telegram is an encrypted form of communication in chat it's not it is but it's not so generally speaking if you're just in a chat group or you're talking to someone in telegram shooting messages back and forth none of that is encrypted the only time that your messages are encrypted is if you spin up specifically a private encrypted chat on Telegram. So to do that, you have to start up an encrypted chat with another individual. Then the, that communication will be encrypted. Also, that only works from phone to phone or mobile device to mobile device. It will not work from the computer. So like I have the Telegram desktop client here so I can talk to people real fast. You can't spin up the private messaging from the desktop client. So it has to be from phone to phone. So if you want to spin up a private encrypted chat on Telegram, what you have to do is first find the contact that you want to spin it up with. Now what you'll notice is when you first go in, you say, oh, hey, I can start talking to this person. I can send, send a secure message. Problem is, this is not secure. The only way to send secure messaging in Telegram is to start a private chat. So what you do is click on their name in the top right little picture, then go to more, then you'll see start secret chat. So when you do that, that will then prompt you, do you want to start a secret chat? You hit start. Then what happens is now you've invited that person into the secret chat. Now everything is encrypted end to end and they're going to be notified, hey, so-and-so is trying to start a secret chat with you. So only then is your communication actually encrypted and private. Everything else is wide open. So please be careful. This happens for a lot of other chat clients out there too. And also think that a lot of government agencies and states do not have access into these or some type of backdoor would be kind of naive as well but for all intents and purposes your other chat is not encrypted so please be careful if you are spinning up if you need to talk about something super important and super you know sensitive make sure that it is in the in the private chat method or do it in person there's a reason skiffs exist use them